Remember, if you're running multicam and you're trying to decide which control device to pair with it, be it an iPad or an Android device, there is one major difference. Not in the multicam app, but in the operating system itself. I'll show you on your iPad when you choose your multicam app. It's going to give you what you're used to seeing. And if you want to run Safari so that you can monitor your comments or maybe even Sideline HD, when you pull Safari up, it's going to let you add it as a slide over but not a split view. So when I tap on the ellipsis there, it shows me that the split view for iOS is not available with Multicam. This tab will always be on top. You can move it from side to side, but you can't make this be half the screen or a part of the screen and Multicam be another part of the screen. By contrast, when we look at the Android tablet, if we choose Multicam, and then we choose multicam in split screen view, it will let us choose a browser as the other side of the screen, which means I can run Sideline HD or I can open up Facebook to get to comments. Uh, this is also resizable. So I can give myself a little bit more real estate here on the multicam side and a little bit less on the other side so that I have a better view.